Uh, hello guys, uh, welcome to Asian Journal Online Academy. Today I'm going to take you through this tutorial on how to find the integral of sine squared x. Okay, so to find the integral of sine squared x, you know, we're going to make use of an uh, identity, a trig identity, and the identity says uh, cos 2x is equal to uh, cos squared x subtract sine squared x. All right. And uh, all right, maybe we can start from how we derive uh, this identity. Uh, this uh, identity is derived from uh, the identity which says uh, cos x plus y is equal to cos x cos y subtract sine x uh, sine y, like this. All right, then uh, from this identity, we take a situation where x is equal to y all right so we're going to substitute x for y in this identity we get cos x plus x which is called cos x uh, cos x subtract sine x sine x like this all right and then as we find this we get cos 2x is equal to cos squared x subtract sine squared x all right so this is the identity which we are going to use but then uh, at this point we're also going to make use of another very common trig identity uh which is uh, sine squared x plus cos squared x is equal to y all right so if we make cos squared x the subject of the formula on this one we get cos squared x is equal to one minus sine squared x okay then what we're going to do we're going to substitute uh, 1 minus sine squared x for cos squared x here on that identity so we're going to say cos 2x is equal to 1 minus sine squared x then subtract sine squared x like this all right then uh simplifying this we get cos 2x is equal to 1 subtract sine squared x to sine squared x all right like this and then uh, if we make sine squared x the subject of the formula on this one we get sine squared x is equal to uh, 1 over 2 divided by 1 minus cos 2x like this all right so uh, to find the integral of sine squared x we're saying integral of sine squared x uh, we're going to substitute sine squared x with this one. So this is the same as the integral of half 1 minus cos 2x. Like this. All right. So this is the thing that we're going to integrate here. So, okay, dx. Like this. All right. So when we integrate, okay, we can take out half. Then when we integrate 1, uh, we are going to get an x. Then subtract when we integrate cos 2x we get uh sine 2x then we multiply uh, by the derivative of the angle which is uh all right but the reciprocal of the derivative we get here so if we differentiate 2x we get a 2 then uh, the reciprocal is 1 over 2 like this all right uh, plus the constant c so here we're going to get 1 over 2x minus uh, sine 2x over then this half multiplied by this half we get uh, f4 here then plus our constant c in the right so squared x and uh, thank you for watching we hope uh, if this was helpful you're going to like and subscribe to our channel thank you very much